Hello guys. <coughs> in this lesson, we will correct our error in this term because uh, the z1 and z3 has a position of the theta m and x, but we have also a z4 term in this position. Okay? Because uh, don't remember it by using this analogy but we should add this equation into the, this one and this form is the stiffness inertia parameter form of the crank model with the wheel dynamics okay and so in the second place we should correct it correction and so correction form of crank model in here and so in order to add the spin coefficient dynamics in here we should write it down as the again z1 x z2 x dot and so it's not an x we should preserve the standard notation Theta m dot z3 x z4 x dot. Okay. This is our general basic notation of this representation. And so z1 dot is equal to what? Z2. Z2 dot is equal to the torque times 1 divided by i crank. This is with the same analogy the previous equation and so plus z1 times minus k egg divided by i crank in here this comes from the theta m value and so x should be added in here k egg divided by i crank times y divided by r okay z3 dot is equal to the z4 and z4 dot is equal to the what z1 times k egg divided by i egg plus z3 times k egg divided by r i k plus z4 comes from the damping ratio of these things and so minus ct divided by r i egg okay and so the a matrices in the state space notation is that the i egg in here is equal to the what i w r m wheel times r plus m crank times r okay and so a can be written as the this term is b1 this term a1 a2 and so this is a3 a4 and a5 okay and so we have the 0 1 0 0 comes from the first dynamic equation and so a1 0 a2 0 0 0 0 1 and in the last term we should add the a5 value in here a3 a4 a5 okay this is our full term as so the b matrices in here 0 b1 0 0 b matrices in the same with the previous one okay and so in order to use the damping spring and inertia modeling techniques in the crank model and so we need to use this state space representation this is our correction form in here because in the previous lesson we don't need to add the damping ratio but the damping ratio should be added into the model and so assume that you have no friction factor on the plane uh, or the wheel is turning on the air and so we can also split or also remove this term in here and so in the removing term this state space representation indicates the spring 
plus inertia representation but this model in here spring plus inertia plus damping ratio which is the best model for the real life application okay in the next session uh, we will create a method swimming diagram and we will cut the whole the state space representation onto the MATLAB simulating platform. Okay?